All right, Jared. OAC grade school. Uh, the the storm is almost past. We're almost to the finals and placement. How's it going this week for you guys in OAC? It's going great. We're in the Conti semis here. We're going to roll right to the finals. We're going to pray to champions, of course. Let the kids walk out to the fog and the, the tunnel and everything. And uh, we'll do a, award the final eight. Uh, final eight guys in each weight. I've talked to everybody who you've built partnerships with here. OAC's done an incredible job of building partnerships. Barbarian Apparel, right? They've done a great job with the final singlets. Yeah. Um, Schmidt's Corner Rugs are on the on the mat, yeah. protecting the mats, and then you know Guy, Guy Seiko. Yep. You know they, that's how you guys wipe up all the yeah. anything the that's skin. on the mat, right? Well, we skin. use the bleach on the, the mats with the skin. The kids wipe off. We got them in the bullpen, so like before the match, we got them out here after the match, we got them on the mats. You know they're coming off the mat, but uh, yeah, and then we have game day up front doing the event apparel, the uh, Sakura with the, the, the paperless system and uh, you know live results. So yeah, we got a lot of people here doing their doing what they do. Why is wrestling? Why are you guys so into like working with wrestling people? Why do wrestlers help wrestlers? Why is that such a, a business model that you kind of epitomize? Well, when you work with wrestlers, you kind of know what kind of effort you're going to get. You know, you, you can't be halfway in wrestling. You can't be halfway in, you know, doing apparel or doing brackets. You know, you, you know, same thing with a guy. You know, you're all the way doing the things right. You know, I was just talking about it. If you're going to do something, you're not going to do it halfway, and that's what wrestlers do, and that's the type of people you want to work with. Numbers, great numbers here. Yeah. Division three is the biggest. Twelve hundred kids. Yeah, twelve hundred kids. Uh, it's yeah. Division three is usually uh, as far as the districts the biggest. Uh, but you know, division three and four are pretty big, uh, big uh, divisions. But twelve hundred plus. I forget what the final number was. Twelve hundred kids. Uh, you know, we've been running on ten matches, crashed down to eight. Uh, we, we have some hopefully some plans in the work for uh, two thousand nineteen to get more kids here. Uh, so we'll see what happens. Girls division. Could yeah, we see the girls. girls division here next year? That's what we're working on, trying to get the girls uh, either the junior high or grade school weekend. Obviously, you know, we changed the schedule this year with NCAA's. We talked last week. Uh, I think it falls. I could be wrong. I think it falls in grade school next year. So we want to get the girls here. I know we just got to make. We got to see how that works out. But girls and some other ideas. So I know there's always something you guys are doing. Um, looking for partnerships always. I know you guys yeah. do a great job with that, but. Uh, Conti semis rolling into finals. You got anything else for me? No, it's going to be some good matches. I can't wait. I'm glad Joe. Thanks, Joe. Joe Williamson's here. Getting some great interviews and you, know, you and him behind the mic. It's like the old original duo, right? You got the band right. back together. The, the band back together. All right, hey, thanks for the time, man. Good luck in the finals, all right? Thanks, man.